you guys started the game, your first four baskets, no assists, 24 in your last 29 minutes. Um, is that what your offense at its best when you guys are sharing the ball like that? I would definitely say so. Uh, we definitely pre-spacing and pacing and keeping the ball moving. And I feel like we really showed that out there tonight. And everybody gets a piece of the pie when we play like that. And so it makes the game really fun. You came into the game number three in the nation and assist to turnover ratio, 12 to zero. You're just not happy with number three. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> uh, man, I'm not really too concerned with all that right now. Uh, definitely something great to be a part of. Uh, something that I really focused on this offseason was just uh, taking care of the ball better, uh, making better reads, you know. Uh, but definitely want to keep it as much as possible and not give it to the other team. So I'm definitely pleased with that. Tatum, when you guys are getting that many assists, what's working right? I feel like everything. I feel like people run into the spaces. You feel me? We just all together, I would say. And like you said, this offseason, we just preached about just taking care of the ball and one more pass and stuff like that. And I feel like we especially did that in the second half. I think at one point there were 12 shot attempts, that 11 turnovers in that first 10 minutes stretch. Yeah, we talked about just urgency, just offensively and defensively, but mainly defensively. Like we just try to get out to the ball early, you feel me? Put a little pressure on them, and see how they handle. Obviously, uh, St. Mary's team versus Piper obviously is going to have to defend well with as I mean, heading into that game and, and just this stretch in general, is that number one priority? But then you know, with that intensity. Uh, it's the number one priority, no matter who we're playing. Man, it's, uh, if we want to go do what we want to do this year, it's going to happen on the defensive end. And so uh, whether we were playing St. Mary's or anybody else, uh, we're going to have to have the right mindset. And like you said, they're a really good team, so it's going to be a tough challenge. But uh, it's something that we're going to have to do if we want to win. Uh, there's a two-step game when you guys have played here yet, but you know, this is a, obviously a very big game coming today. <coughs> How exciting is it to you know, have this opportunity? I feel like it's very exciting. Like we played them last year, and obviously it didn't go our way, so we got a little chip on our shoulder this time. And they come into our place, and I feel like as long as we just keep doing what we're doing, keep doing what coach emphasizing us and embracing our roles and stuff like that, I feel like everything should be good. Is this what you guys have talked about? This is what you want to build to? Is this uh, you know just kind of next step in that of having you know Marquee Dan and Logan with you know with Jay Crazy out? <laughs> For sure, uh, I can't wait for it. Uh, like you said, they're a really good team, man, and it's going to be a battle. Uh, but they're going to compete. We're going to compete. It's going to be a fun game. And uh, definitely excited to see how Moby looks uh, on Saturday. Yes, sir. Appreciate y'all. <laughs> <laughs>